This is an example of a nonverbal code question. In nonverbal codes, it's very important to look for similarities in the code and relate those to similarities within the shape. For example, here, you can see that both of these two shapes have a three. Both of these shapes are also black. Here we can see both of the shapes are gray and the second digit of their code is a two. So the second letter or digit of the code must relate to the color. Now, there's also an A and a B for the first digit. Here, we can look at another difference, which is the outline of the shape. So to solve our code, we can see that it is um, hollow in the middle. It has no color. So it is going to be one. And we can see from the outline of the shape that it is the same as the one above. And this one over here, meaning that it must be A, one.